Hey, it's Raj from 3CB. Barcelona and Dutch starlet Frankie de Jong has missed the club's last three games and was recently diagnosed with a soleus tear in his right calf with no definitive timetable for his return. He's reportedly upset with the Barca medical staff with what he believes to be an initial misdiagnosis and is considering returning home for the remainder of his physio. In this video, I'll detail De Jong's injury, return timeline, and alleged rift with the Barcelona medical staff. Let's start with some anatomy. The return timeline on soleus injuries often depends on the specific location of the tear. For example, research indicates that the average return from a tear to the myotendinous lateral portion of the soleus is 19 days, whereas a tear to the myotendinous central portion is 44 days, a 25-day difference. We have no specifics on de Jong's injury. Further, rehab for soleus injuries can be tricky due to the high load and sensitivity of the calf complex. Accordingly, Barcelona's medical staff have given no set return timeline, saying the quote, evolution of the injury will condition the player's availability, end quote. Frankie's frustration, if true, may stem from the fluctuation in return timelines as he's gone from being on the bench versus Leganes to being held out of training to now potentially facing multiple weeks out. Further, the Barcelona medical staff has recently dealt with numerous soft tissue injuries. For example, Jordi Alba's adductor and hamstring issues, Guzmani Dembele's hamstring issues that have recurred multiple times. Fair or not, both of those are highly recurring injuries. Those optics don't add confidence for De Jong. Based on what I've seen, heard, and read, particularly from the handling of Dembele's injury and now De Jong's reported conflict, the crux of the issue may be poor communication and setting of expectations. That being said, it's not my place to judge anyone's medical staff without knowing more. There's too many details we aren't privy to on the outside, and calf injuries are notoriously difficult to deal with. There's so much gray area. A prime example is Golden State Warrior at the time, Kevin Durant's extended ordeal with a calf injury during the 2018 NBA playoffs. To end on some good news, one factor that's significantly related to quicker return to play is younger age. At 23 years young, Frankie certainly falls into that category. That's a wrap for this video. Thanks for watching. My goal is to provide you with in depth, evidence based, narrative free analysis. You can always find me on IG and Twitter at 3CB Performance. Take care of yourselves and follow the appropriate precautions to limit your exposure to and spread of COVID-19. Make sure to sub to the channel and follow along on all social media for latest updates. 3CB out.